Hi, this is Dave Severns with the Los Angeles Clippers. And today we're going to talk about the hurry up offense, sometimes known as the pistol offense or the 21 offense. It's called a lot of different things, probably made most famous by Coach Mike D'Antoni when he was with the Phoenix Suns. I'm sure once you see what we're doing on the court, you will recognize some of the actions, but we call it the hurry up offense. Not that we're trying to play fast, but it's with a flow and with a pace and can get you quick shots early in the shot clock. What it is, is an offense that can create quick shots with great spacing. Say you're down eight to 10 points and it's late in the game, what do you have to go to that can get some quick scores for you and get you back into the game? Doesn't necessarily mean you have to use it only at the end of the game. This is an offense that is used any time of the game and is played with great pace and great flow. We may go five to seven minutes stretches in a game where this is all we're running if it's successful. Uh, why you would run this is because we think it opens up the floor, gives tremendous spacing for three-point shooters, it gives great spacing for drives and the pick and roll game. The way we're going to teach the hurry up offense is by two on O, three on O, and five on O breakdown drills, mainly in the half court. And then towards the end, we'll get into some three quarter court drills to teach the hurry up offense spacing and timing. In teaching the hurry up offense, we'd like to break it down into six different areas. The first thing being the setup, the timing, the spacing. The second would be the chase action. Third would be keep. Fourth would be the dribble action. Fifth would be the down. And finally, the last option would be the at. So let's take a look at the hurry up offense.